Today is Monday, July 14th, and uh, it's my last week. And on Friday, I'm going to have this Bigfoot removed, which is named a Bigfoot because it's it looks like a, really more than a Bigfoot. But anyway, um, I'm very excited. This has been a, an amazing process. What really made the whole shift for me in the healing was sitting here on my Pilates machine. There's not much I can do in getting cardiovascular exercise like um, getting on my bike or anything else. So I was able to use this Pilates machine and if it wasn't for the Pilates machine, I think that my energy level would have been a lot less. Also, I, I've been playing a lot of music with the exercising which helps to motivate me. And um, one of the things that I do want to do is the cardiovascular. Yesterday, I kind of hopped around a little bit, running around in the walker and the crutches helps. Um, but I've been here in, in the house in the last five weeks, hardly going out, just a couple times. Um, but the, the big, big difference for me has been feeling strong in my body, and that has helped me to, to um, regain my sense of structure. So for me the exercise has been such an important thing for, for creating a structure to feeling focused and um, um, to, to plan ahead what's my next step. And one of the persons that really motivates me in this life is my best friend Alina. She's Miss Structure, the epitome of structure. to uh, show that video to other patients that were um, uh, nervous about getting this type of surgery. So it's ready to come off. It's been kind of my like now my little pal. I almost don't feel it. It's it is I do feel it but it's not so painful. Um, but it's weird how you get accustomed to things. And um, so it's gonna come off on Friday. I was very nervous about getting it done in the house in the office because they have to pull these pins out from my bone. There's about eight of them and it's all drenched into the bone. Um, and I wanted to go into the hospital and get it under anesthesia but then I decided to brave it out and not make such a drama and I'm going to do it at the office on Friday and um, then I'm off to physical therapy. So I'm very excited for all the new things that are coming my way because that's what I've been envisioning and sometimes there's chaos around our lives and these times to pause are, are very helpful to um, reintegrate, restructure, to rethink and to um, just clear your mind so that you can just continue moving forward in a, in a very positive and um, motivated way. 